in this part we will design of center pivot for the sprinkler irrigation in the study area in every maker and connecting it with the blocks of sprinkler irrigation which were designed in the previous parts we open the model maker or early maker program then we open the previous design of of the blocks of sprinkler irrigation by going to the file menu Then open all. Then in the project file, we open the previous design for the blocks of sprinkler irrigation titled complete project dot mil. Then the previous design for the blocks of sprinkler irrigation appears. It is worth noting here that if the pipes and the pump for this design did not appear, we go above and we press on the contours display toggle. Then Then we replace repress on the contour display toggle again as we see. Then we go to the menu bar on the left. Then we press on the irrigation menu. Then a new window titled Irrigation appears and in it we go to the project menu. Then we go to the block at the right. Then we choose the zero block. Then we check the units as we see. Then we start designing the center pivot in, in every maker by going to the pivot menu. Then we press on the manage pivots, then add pivots. Then in the pivot name, we type pivot. And in the pivot description, we type pivot1. Then we go to the pivot spans. And in it, in the length field, in the first line, we choose, for example, a 20 meter. As we see, and in the number of field, in number of field, we choose eight. 
then we go to the overhang and we choose 10 and in the end then we choose 10 then in the circle size degrees we choose 360 then we specify the location of the center pivot system in the study area by pressing on the defined pivot center coordinates Then the center pivot system appears and we locate its location in the study area by left click, then OK. Then we tick on the valve, then OK. Then the location of the center pivot system and its valve in the center is specified in the study area. Then in the irrigation pivot window, we go to the pivot operation menu and in it we specify the options as we see then we press on the run report Then the design information appears in the operation report field and in it we go to the required flow which is 169.57 meter cube per hour. Then we copy this value via control C. Then we go to the Pressure and the flow menu. And in it, we paste the required flow in the flow field via control V. Then in the pressure field, we choose 70 meter. Then we press on the arrow. Then we press on the edit value edit values then in the pipe diameter window we specify the options as we see Then we press on OK. Then the design values appear as we see. While as we see the actual values in the vault did not appear because the design does not complete yet so we go to the pivot hydraulics menu and in it we press on the run flow calculations then the hydraulics values for the design appear as we see Then we press on the close. Then we return 
to the irrigation window and the design details for the center pivot system appear as we see 